Hi guys, so um, it's gonna be noisy and there's a person behind me putting makeup on because a friend is in from out of town and we're going out tonight, so out tonight. Okay, sidetrack. Anyway, um, so this has to be quick. I was gonna do it yesterday, but then I didn't wake up till five in the afternoon, so yeah. But anyway, so this is a book review, um, mainly focusing on the characters of the book of Blood and Shadows. I was gonna say the book called the Book of Blood and Shadows, but that sounds repetitive. So the Book of Blood and... I can't speak. I'm sorry. I'm scatterbrained. Ah! Anyway, um, characters are definitely the strong point in this book. Um, there were a few things I didn't really like about the book, how, um, it seemed like all of the clues were really obvious. Kind of? I don't know. They were too easy. It was too easy for me. But, um, I definitely, I definitely loved the book. Uh, it was really good. Um, so it's told from Nora's perspective, who is the main character, and she is translating all of these letters by this lady Elizabeth, who was the original person to try and find this, this thing that, like, yeah... I don't want to give too much away, but um, pretty much it starts out, that's structure, but it starts out where Nora is, um, is finding out that her best friend died and his girlfriend is sitting there with like blood on her hands and her boyfriend is the accused murderer at, at, at the beginning. So it... It was kind of, um, weird, and then it backtracks to show the entire relationship, and my god, I love Chris. I wanted her to be with Chris way more than Max, and I just, it was one of those things where I usually, why are you looking at me like that? I'm giving a book review. This is a, like, people are gonna see me doing this. My mom's looking at me strange. I told you this is gonna be a bad one, um, cause I'm all hyped up and ready to go and blah 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 blah. Um, but anyway... So, um, yeah, I definitely wanted Nora and Chris to be together way more than Nora and Max. It was one of those he was her best friend thing and, like, it fit well and they had better moments together, so I liked Chris a lot more than Max. Max was so moody sometimes. I don't know. He just, he didn't, as much as the author tried to make it seem, he didn't really fit with Nora well enough in my perspective, which I loved Nora as a character. She was totally believable, um, as rational as she was in the situation she was in. That was like the most unbelievable thing, and even then, it really well done. Um, but I loved Nora, how nerdy she was. Um, it, it was someone easy to relate to. Um, so, yeah, overall, really like the book. I definitely recommend you checking it out. Um, and I will also annotate the, um, my review from last week. I'm sorry I didn't post it. I broke my toe and I was at somebody else's house working. And it was just a bad week for making videos. Um, I ac yeah. So, I'm gonna stop, I'm gonna stop stumbling over my words. And, um... Yeah. Good book. Go check it out. Bye, guys. <laughs>